single ingredient we're going to make. So mm -hmm. We're going to make some Frito Turkey Chili today. Yeah. I'm Shelly. This is, what's your name? Um, Kathleen Ruth Rocket. Katie Ruth. That's her name. Yeah. Okay, so Katie and I are going to make some Frito Turkey Chili. Mm -hmm. And it's really easy. And a lot of the stuff you can get out of your garden yeah. if you wanted to. Today we're going to use, most of it's going to be from cans. Yeah. We have a few things from the garden that we're going to use. Yes. But, yeah, it's going to be good. Yeah. It's going to be delicious. Yes. You ready to get started? Yes. Okay, let's so do it. Thing, first thing we're going to do is cook some ground up turkey. This is 85% lean. You can use whatever you want. That's just what I have. You could use beef if you wanted to. And all I'm going to do is fry it up in my Dutch oven. Okay, now that I've browned the turkey, I drained off any of the grease that was in there as much as possible anyway. I cut up two small onions. It takes one um, one large onion or however many you like. If you don't like onions, don't put onions in it. I also did a jalapeno, just one. I've got them coming out my ears in the garden. So I chopped one of those up and I brought another one in to put, to chop up and put on the top when it's, um, when it's all done, if you want to garnish it. So we're just gonna let that cook down for a couple minutes and then we'll start adding the ingredients. Okay, so normally I would uh, have this on the stove with the heat on low while I put the stuff in, but Katie wants to help me today. So we've got the turkey browned and we put diced onion and some jalapeno in there. That's up to you whether you want to do I, that. You can I add didn't. or take away whatever you want. I didn't either. You didn't, no. So we have two cans of pinto beans. Yeah. You can use whatever kind of beans that you want. There's chili beans, there's really? navy beans, I don't know, whatever you want to put in. Scott doesn't like anything but pinto beans, so we're going to make this to his liking. And anyway, it's it's delicious, whatever yeah. you put in it for beans. So Katie, would you like to help me put the beans in? Yeah. All right, pour them right in, the whole can. Yep, good job. <laughs> it's okay, we'll wipe it. Here, here's another one. I'll get that one. Pour that one in. Nice sound effects. <laughs> okay. Can you wipe it off? Uh, all right, I did. Oh, we have a little spill. Can we go? Okay, heaven forbid. Heaven forbid if we get a little dirty while we're cooking. Yeah. Okay, and so the next thing is fire roasted diced tomatoes. If you don't want fire roasted, just do the diced tomatoes. And we'll put a can of that in. That's something you could get from your garden if you do that yourself. Would you like to give that a stir? Yeah. Okay, go right ahead. Can you do it without splattering it everywhere? Okay, so we're gonna take a half a teaspoon of chili powder. Let's make sure that's my half, yes. And I'm gonna do this part just while she's stirring. And we're gonna put that in. Mm. And then we're also gonna take, that looks really good, huh? Yeah. We're also going to take a so teaspoon of Can I pour that in? the taco seasoning. Yep, hang on a minute. If I can get it out of the thing. Okay, there's one. Two. And I want to get it full. doesn't want to fill up. There we go. Two. Two. So taco seasoning, you can buy these in great big jars instead of just in the our containers instead of just in the little packages that taco uh, kits come in. So you can buy them like this. Very handy. And yes, we can pour that in. What is that? That's tomato sauce. It's 15 ounces of tomato sauce. So we want to put that in. Yep, go ahead and pour it right in. That's going to help thicken along with the tomato paste. There's six ounces of tomato paste here. And that's going to help thicken the chili. Now this is a quick, easy chili. This isn't, um, you know, the ones that you do that take hours and hours to cook down. This is just a quick, 
quick fun little meal that you can make obviously with a four-year-old for the most part there so I just put the um, paste in like I said six ounces of that let me give that a stir can you stir it and we're going to cook that on the stove medium heat for about oh 30 minutes or so till it gets all mixed together and thickens up nicely so we're just going to mix it all right up okay so this is what it looks like with all the ingredients in there doesn't that look delicious nice chunky chili it's already actually pretty thick i did pour off the pinto bean some of the pinto bean juice i could have left it in there but this is going to be a nice thick chili we're going to put this on the on the stove like i said for about medium heat for about 30 minutes or so check it check it and we'll see what it looks like it may go on a little bit longer. it's all cooked and now we're going to hang on wait wait whoa whoa we're gonna we're gonna put the actually you can put this together however you want but how we put it together is we take fritos these yeah. are the lightly salted they just came out with these not too long ago yeah i like that because i don't want a lot of salt if you want salt put it on yourself yeah so let's put a little bit of fritos at the yeah. bottom of your bowl okay okay that's going to be our base you want a little more Wow. There. Okay. Oh, that looks good. More. A few more. A few more Fritos. Oh my. <laughs> Would you like some Frito? Would you like some chili with your Fritos, dear? Yes. Yeah. My goodness gracious. Okay. So now we're going to take some of our chili. We're going to give Katie just a little because I don't know if she's going to like it. Mm. And you put it on top of your Fritos. Can I put these what? now? And then, yep. And then we're going to put some cheese on there so it will melt. Do you want some taco cheese? Uh, yes, sure. Sure. We have taco cheese and we have fiesta cheese. You could use mozzarella, you could use cheddar, whatever you want. Would, do you want to do it? Yeah. Okay. It's you, cold. Yeah, it is cold because it's in the. I keep my cheese in the freezer because I buy it by the big bag. Can I have? Is that about enough? Can I have a taste? Some? You can taste some. T Let's taste test the cheese. Uh huh. What do you think? delicious okay now we can put our toppings on I cut up tomatoes lettuce some jalapeno and onion so then you can put those on top I'll get yours okay you can go ahead I'll have some lettuce sure sprinkle it right on there do you want some lettuce on yours yeah okay and then oh. what those are some jalapenos is that much no that's good because it's probably be too hot for me I did de-seed them and so there's no seeds in the jalapenos so they're not too too hot and the thing is this is a mild chili if you want it to be hotter put more chili seasoning in um, and stuff like that so there look at that and so now Katie's putting some tomatoes on no yeah tomatoes <coughs> oh wow that looks great and that then garlic nope I didn't do garlic oh. did you do on oh yeah put onion on that's great yeah I'd love some onion. onion it's almost like a chili pie would you like some sour cream we put sour cream on the top would you like some sour cream yeah. a little squirt yeah I'll do that because it's really easy to get too much how's that good um, good okay can I taste some on my finger yeah because I don't even know if you like sour cream it's good, but you might not like it. Try it. Mm. You like it? Uh -huh. Okay, so that's pretty good for you? Uh -huh. Okay, so spoon. Okay. Baby Yoda. Are you going to put, what are you putting on there? Oh, you're putting more onions? Here's your Baby Yoda bowl. Some more salad, a little bit of salad. Okay, let's try it. Grammy's interested on in seeing what it's going to taste like. Here, get your spoon and let's try it. You try it with me at the same time. Okay. See if we like it. I'm not Hopefully, sure. it's not too hot. Grammy's going to try to get a little of everything on there. 
Okay. And you get those Fritos down at the bottom. Just smush them up. Yeah, just kind of smush them up. Okay. You ready to try it? Yes. Okay. I'm going to try a salad. Just, just put some on your spoon. Ready? Here we go. You're going to try lettuce? You don't like the lettuce? Mm, I don't like. Where should I put this? I'll take it. Try the chili. You don't like lettuce, but try the chili. Here it is. Look at it with cheese and chili. look at that. Try that. Mm, chili. Take a piece of the chip off. There you go. It's got a little bit on there. You love the corn chips. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you love the corn chips. Anyway, this is a fun meal. I just thought we would share. And Katie wanted to help me. Getting brave. She's going to take a bite. Let's do it. Ready? One, two, three, go. Mm -hmm. mm. Yeah. Oh. I am That's really good. All right. The taste test over. The taste test is over. Did you like it? Are you giving it a thumbs up or thumbs down? Mm. Thumbs down? You don't like my chili? You just didn't like the lettuce. Okay. Anyway, I give it a thumbs up. She's going in for the chili. Mm. <laughs> is it good? You like it. delicious isn't it yeah it's good anyway I love the chili. good and chili beans good you just didn't like the lettuce mm -mm. right that's okay mm -hmm. no lettuce chili good all right <laughs> i'm gonna have some chili again okay there's more in there so let's just dig in all right thanks for watching guys you want to say bye katie bye